One of the major challenges that we had is we weren't sure what the capacity of our staff was. So we worked with center staff to really go through an assessment process and look at our capacity and our activity levels around healthcare transformation. And then we're able to build action plans around um, where we wanted to go, what steps were important, and then have measurable results in the end. This was really instrumental for leading us into a systems integration grant that we were awarded. It served like a planning piece to what we were going to do in the integration grant, so that was super helpful for us. Um, the other result was just to um, to see the success of bringing together this diverse group of people who were involved in care coordination in some way or shape or form and to see the energy that they had and the interest that they had. And I think this will really serve us in going forward um, as a group of people that we can access when we need customer input. I think the center's opportunity came about at a perfect time and um, for me professionally, I was two months into my job at the Department of Health and it actually helped me to be able to gain a greater sense of what MCH is about, how we do our work, and to interact with you know, various states as resources and with the center, which the coaching they provided even helped me you know, professionally in the work that I do. And also being able to build these teams, and I talk about like one of our project goals was to develop this collaborative environment. It also helped me to develop and facilitate these various relationships across state agencies that have actually helped me outside of this project with uh, my work with Title V. So the center is preparing for the second round of states to participate in our intensive cohort two. And we're really excited that we had such a successful launch last year with cohort one. We've learned a lot. We've tweaked some of our programming. We've included some of our feedback from the first set of states. And so we really feel like we have a, a dynamic program to offer the states.